All right, so today is uh, is a bailing day. Um, uh, what I'm gonna do first is uh, I've kind of waited a little bit late, I'm trying to get let the dew dew burn off. I had some stuff to do this morning, but um, what I'm about to do is I'm gonna try to repair my switch, my limit switch, and try to get it out of the way from where it was the last time because I broke it. So I've got another switch. So hopefully there's not gonna be a whole lot of talking to this one. I'm gonna um. It's probably gonna be a time lapse, so I'm probably gonna speed it up so that way you ain't gotta just it'd be a long video, but it's probably gonna take a few minutes. So I'm about to jump up there and hopefully I can catch it. Uh, if there's something I need to say, I'll I'll stop and explain it to you. But um, I'll show you what I do at the end. That took a little bit, a few, it took, I figured it'd take one or two minutes, but it wound up taking about five. So, um, I might have screwed up by painting it, but, um, I kind of need to tell the difference in the line, so I may fix that later. But right now, that's, uh, I can't change it. So, I tried to, um, come up with a good alternative for that, for the switch not getting hit. And I've taken a lot of slack out of it as far as the travel and being hit. So I'm going to show you what, I, what I've done. And it may not be a permanent fix, but if it works good, it may be a permanent fix. Okay, so it was this easy. is my new switch. It was down this way. That was the bottom of it right there. I don't know if you can see there's a little line right there. That's where the bottom of it was originally. And I had to move it because when it come up, it would hit it. So what I've done... Is I put zip ties on it and hopefully that will hopefully I, I put black paint so when the black when I stop seeing black paint I should be good and the way I've got it stripped is if I see black paint that's too far um I'm about to crank it up on bail hopefully I get some some video of that but um I'm not real sure um so hopefully hopefully it goes well I'm just gonna grease it up and make sure it's ready to go.
I got done bailing, it took me about an hour and a half. Um, my alarm did really good. I could hear it through my headphones while listening to music. So um, I didn't, I was real cautious this time because I did not want to start a bell off fast and get clogged up like I done with the other one. So um, I was real cautious of that. So I th think I got 13 bells, which is good. It's a small area so i'm gonna show you what i did um but my my twine arm did really well and i'm about to use my front and loader with hay spears so hopefully hopefully that goes well